How's it going, Phil? Her is my name is Christosaurus. Today we're going to be checking out Pawnee Hoff's Mally Ghost Boomkin Druid deck. So, up against a warrior. I keep these cards. Nice. Got double wild growth. It's pretty good. With the feral rage here. I think it's a pretty safe bet. This is this actually a control warrior? Bog champ? Control warrior still exists, Bog champ? That ramp. That ramp, though. Here's a dragon warrior. Okay. Is ghoul, we get pretty wrecked here, but nothing we can do about it. Not anything else to play, so feels bad, man. Actually, I have to execute too. I think we just lose the game if he does, maybe. Nope, okay. This is still not necessarily good, but at least they have the execute. He would have had that, I'm pretty sure we would have lost. Uh oh. Hmm. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Good boy. Big boa. Dude, we only got 18 damage on board. Yo, what's up, Doctor? What's up, Silver? How you guys doing? Hey, feels good, man. So if he doesn't have an execute here, he's going to be getting pretty jacked up. He's got another taunt. Feels bad, man. Alright, so he has Crusher in his hand if he's triggering this again. Pretty sure I attack with this, even though he can kill us with ghoul now, but it's okay. Still hit him in the face for 10. Should be GG. He shouldn't have any more uh, taunts. If he gets another ghoul and he, or if he has another ghoul in his hand and he draws the execute, then we get pretty wrecked, because then he could trade in with the axe still too. But this will at least allow us to draw some cards, alright. I'll we'll draw something, but... Hope y'all are fine too. Uh, yeah, I'm pretty good except for losing uh, one and four to Ragnaros. I just lost the game because of that. Glad to hear that, Doctor. Glad you're doing good, man. Love your videos, dude. Keep it up. Hey, thanks, uh, OMR RD. Appreciate that, man. Oh, he had this. Eh, it's not bad. Ah, uh, this is our beast though, I think, that we draw, right? I think now we're gonna just draw a dragon. Oh, wait, oh yeah, we have another beast. Forgot about that. Lol. Well, I think this is GG, boys. Actually, maybe we shouldn't have traded. Well. Eh. Well, in order for him to activate to execute, he needs like a slam or a ghoul, right? 
He d he seriously doesn't have. I'm actually shocked that he doesn't have execute. They almost always have it when they need it. Whoa. <laughs> Just like, okay, bro. <laughs> we can tell who the skilled player is here. Feels good, man. Yeah, I'll, I'll keep up the good videos, man. I'm actually making a video right now. I can uh, link the uh, video to you guys. If you guys want to check it out. It's kind of like the Maligus Druid that's been going around. It's got the Moonkin in it, too. I think uh, Sho is playing a deck like basically similar to this. The only thing is different. I think that this one has a uh, Kodo in it. And now we got another AFK player. Hopefully not. Okay. Looks like they might not be AFK, but it's so annoying when they AFK. Lol for his mage lol. Actually, I maybe should have done this, huh? Well, it kind of depends. Is it? I mean, it might not be a freeze mage. It's most likely a freeze mage, right? Like, Reno doesn't play this. Pretty sure, right? Definitely need to ramp. Um, definitely gonna need to use this for armor too. I'm sure. Oh my god. Yeah, I'm just gonna do it here. Whatever. I don't really care about saving it on this. Can't really do anything this turn anyway. So, I'm not just gonna play this and then have him fireball it. Right. Need to get a nourish soon. The thing that sucks is like we can't really burst him down. I'm actually surprised to see a uh, freeze mage. I haven't seen one for a little while. But it kind of makes sense because there's like literally no control warriors on ladder. Which is weird. I feel like control warrior is not bad right now. Alright, that's fine. We can do both of these. Whatever. Um. I'm gonna draw more cards too, though. Crap. Alright, whatever. I guess we draw a card off of this. See what we get. Nourish. That's pretty good. Alright, I'm actually gonna do this. Yeah, that's really good. Oh, baby, a triple. And then. Could hero power, but I don't really want to take the damage. The burst would be pretty nice though, but yeah, we can maybe, actually, you know, we might be able to do enough damage to him before he ice blocks, maybe. And he's almost halfway through his deck. If we can pop his ice block early, like, Rag should be pretty good against Freeze Mage. For the most part, I would think. Should be awkward for him to deal with. Hmm. Yeah, we need to try to burst them down. Alright, we're gonna drop Rag here. Do 8 damage to his face. Feels good, man. Getting Emperor would be pretty cool. We've actually drawn more cards than him, too. It's probably gonna have to use a Fireball on this, so it's not bad. Okay, let's get the... You know, that could be Ice Barrier, and we could kill him here, possibly. Cool. Well. 
Dude, if we had Malagos, he'd be dead. Two, three. This is five. Four, four. Five plus eight, thirteen. That's actually lethal. This is not ice block, it's lethal. Actually, we only need to do 10 damage to him, so I don't think we need to play both. Will it be enough to just play this, though? 2, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. It's not enough. I have to play this. Oh. Alright, well, we're just going to yellow here. I was gonna say he doesn't have it. <gasps> it wasn't ice block. <laughs> These people, like, I, I remember when I first started YouTube, and like I was uploading to Hearthbone. Um, it's people all the time. Um, like when more people were watching my videos, it was really cool because then I would look on the demographics of where people were viewing from and it'd be like all over the world. It's crazy. I don't know. It was just a cool feeling to be like, oh wow, there's like some person on the other side of the world that like enjoys watching my content. It's just like kind of cool. Think that you like never have met this person and they're like a fan of yours. I don't know. It's just... It's almost like mind blowing, I guess. It's like the thought of it at first. But, yeah, it's really cool. Well, out of the Drake, turn three. Ooh, I wish I would have had that before. Dang. Backstab, damn. SI? Oh my god. Dude, well played, dude. Holy crap, man. Oh, well. Oh, it's so good. Oh, I gotta do it. I just gotta do it, man. Oh, I love, I love the Raven Idol on Fandral. It's so awesome. Harrison Jones, I'll take it. Swipe or Moonfire, ooh. I feel like the swipe beam might be more practical early on because it can kill his auctioneers right the moon fire is more like for going ham with the combo right the only problem with australia is it is full of australians i'm kiwi haha <laughs> wait what why is that a problem yeah they're great feels good man lol discover last dude skill dude that face flow face what the hell <laughs> That's so creepy, dude. Oh my god, dude, his face. <laughs> no, not eviscerate. Dan's game. Aw, oh, if only he didn't attack there. Dude, this is so hilarious as getting this. It's actually freaking hilarious. Alright, whatever. Cool. You have to kill the sapling. It will live on. So hopefully what he does is he attacks into this. Since it's turn 5, like he probably doesn't really have anything to do, right? Unless he has like Tomb Pillager. But hopefully he attacks into it and then um, weapons up again. Ah, that actually kind of sucks. Feels bad, man. Um, hmm. Hmm. I guess we just swipe here. Kind of wanted to save that for his auctioneer, but I still have this too to kill his auctioneer with. But I kind of also want to armor up with that, so it kind of depends. I need to draw cards too. I just want him to weapon. Just weapon up here, please. Just weapon. Do it, do it, do it, do it. Yes. Really? You're going to attack? 
Why would you attack? Makes no sense. Literally makes no sense. Oh, that's a card. That's definitely a card. Oh, that's a card too. Oh, baby. Oh, baby, here he comes. Why would you attack with your weapon there? That makes no sense. Why would you do that? This is actually a better play than the Harrison anyways, so... If if she wouldn't have attacked, I might have went with the Harrison still. So... And then we would have had to Wrath that and not draw a card, but... I guess actually it's the same amount of card draw. We just would have had a 5-4 versus a uh, minion with spell damage. This is so hilarious though that we got this off of freaking Raven Idol. It's so awesome. I swear, if he gets a new barack, I'm gonna flip. Backstab? Oh my god, oh, okay. Dan's game, dude. Ugh. Okay, we got another one now. I guess we'll use it. Draw last, forehead. Draw last, oh yeah. RG, I mean, it doesn't really matter if we draw a last there, because we're we're going to do that no matter what. Like, we got to kill the Drake. We're not going to leave a Drake on board. Auctioneer turn? Oh my god. Clown Fiesta. Why would you attack there? Why do you attack? I don't get it. Makes no sense. Whoa. Whoa. Dude, zero mana moonfire. GG Mally. Eh? <laughs> Makes lots of sense. No, it doesn't. <laughs> this guy, he, I mean, I guess he's wanting to get in the extra damage, and he can always weapon, like, re weapon. I mean, I guess, like, that's right, but I don't know. I guess I'm just more triggered because I have Harrison in my hand, forehead. Dude. I have no time for games. I have no time for games. What the fuck? Broski. You know you're trading, right? Okay. Wait. Oh, yeah. He was bad, man. Does he have sap, too? Wow, dude. Dan's game. I think we actually might be screwed here. Wait, do we have lethal? This is six. Ten. No. Uh, I don't know damage. Hmm. Hmm. I think we what we need to do is I think we need to like rag and arcane giant. But it, no, that's so bad. Like, what do we do against this? Hmm. Oh my god. I want to... I think we need to rag, but it's just like... He steals something, though. I'm gonna just do this. Draw a card. I really don't know what to do, man. I don't even know what to do. <laughs> that, was such, that was a bad play. <laughs> that was a misplay. Don't, by the way, don't do that. Don't do that. Uh, we should have uh, not swiped there, I think. Yeah, we should have just chilled. If you just didn't have this card, and the cloak, like the cloak was just so bad. He got a cloak and he got deal two damage, like, what do you do? Oh my god. So stupid, dude. 
Alright, um, probably screwed here. Yeah, honestly, I don't even know what to do. Can I just do this? I can't even do this. I, yeah, I, don't, I don't even know what I'm doing. Whatever, I don't even know what I'm doing. Yellow. I think we're dead. <laughs> Did you use both of his rates, though? He can sap this, and then he'll still rag. By the way, this is not how you're supposed to play this game. <laughs> See, if he has Phantom Knives too, we get wrecked. Oh my god, we're gonna get so wrecked, dude. Yeah, now he's gonna steal a rag. Fuh. Good news is, I think we still win. How much damage is this? I think it's exactly lethal, huh? I think we still win, right? Probably shouldn't even count it, right? Lol. <laughs> we misplayed that so hard, dude. But we still won. Wow. That was exactly lethal, nice. Alright, well, I'm gonna go ahead and end the video here since I obviously suck. <laughs> so, if you guys enjoyed this video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. For those of you guys watching through YouTube, I'm gonna put the deck list in the description below so you can check out the deck on her phone. Like always, thank y'all so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Stay chill, peace out.